Hello again, my friends. And to everybody who is watching this, I am coming to you with another Amazon video for the month of September. And this is um, uh, 10 items that sold over $15. Um, I had a very bad uh, month selling on Amazon FBA. Um, so therefore, I have very um, a few 10 items to be exact, to show you. Let's get started. First item that sold is this Imaginetics Travel Bingo. Uh, picture bingo. Um, when you're traveling, you see these uh, items pictured on your um, card and you put a little magnetic thingy on it. Um, kind of like to check it off. And it sold for $19.99. I believe I got it for about $1.19 at Goodwill and it was new in a package. This is an interesting puzzle and as you can see there's uh, only one collectible used and probably one on Amazon. Um, it's a puzzle um, of peonies by Hel Helen Coleman and it's 500 pieces and it's very beautiful. Um, all the pieces Mine was used, so I had to count all the pieces, and uh, everything was in there. And it sold for $39.99. I believe I have uh, one more similar um, listed. I believe this one, the other one is roses. Um, and um, I don't remember how much I paid for it, uh, but I do remember that I got it at the Goodwill store. This is a puzzle by Ravensburger. It's a Germany brand and this one's called Morning Glory. It was 1000 piece puzzle. Mine was used and um, all the pieces were there. I love selling Raven, Ravensburger um, puzzles because you can make a profit um, selling on them and they're very nice high quality design. As you can see they sell fairly quickly and there's not many um, on Amazon. Um, as of now and mine was used and I sold it for $16. Um, I probably picked it up under $2. Here is another Boyd's Bear. This is Winston. Um, as I mentioned in my previous last Amazon sales video, um, I picked him up in the Goodwill outlet store and he probably cost me about a dollar or so. He was new and uh, this one sold for $23.99. This is a um, paperback big book. It's uh, those books that you um, would or teachers would read to um, in classrooms. Um, it was a bigger size. Um, I found a bunch of them probably for $1.99 at the Goodwill store and um, this certain one sold for $29.99. They don't sell fairly quickly, um, so they. And this one's been laying there for I think two months. I have a few more that I have listed, so hopefully they'll sell um, when uh, a new school year will start. This was super tiny and very very cute. Um, T Y Beanie Baby, and this is the Pookie the Bear from Garfield. He was just adorable, and. Um, there's a whole bunch on Amazon listed, but mine sold for $19.49 and he was new with tags. I don't remember how much I paid for him, probably around a dollar. Here's an awesome sale. This is a Jelly Cat Cordy Roy Red Bear Plush. He was 16 inches. As you can see, mine was the only one available on Amazon. Um, it looks like they don't even have them. Um, uh, on Amazon at all, but who knows, I could be wrong. Um, and I found this at the Goodwill store. I probably paid $1.19 for him, and he sold for $44.90. Um, I wanted to price him uh, very high because, as I said, mine was the only one listed. And it sold um, fairly quickly. Um, I always pick these Jelly Cat um, plush because they sell well, especially these um, corduroy little guys. They're adorable and um, kids love them. And as I mentioned um, before, with these Leapfrog Leap Reader books, um, I like to bundle them. That way, um, a person who is interested in purchasing them, they um, can get some kind of value out of it because they do sell fairly high at the department stores. Um, but these two, 
uh, Dora and the Cat in the Hat sold for eighteen eighty, and I probably got them for about uh, fifty cents each, so a dollar for two. This is a Kodak Premium picture paper, and mine sold fairly high um, comparing to what they have right now. Uh, mine sold for nineteen ninety nine, and I probably paid. Uh, around a dollar for it at the Goodwill store. And my last sale of the month is this Westminster Shorter Catholic Chism with cartoons. I, I don't know. From 1996. And actually I was debating if I should send this um, to Amazon. Um, I was going to just toss it because I do not like listing these on eBay or listing books on eBay because of the high competition um, but anyways it sold for $26.99 to my surprise and um, and mine was actually a hard cover uh, I guess it states that it's paperback in the listing but yeah um, it was a good sale I probably got it for uh, 50 cents at my um, Goodwill uh, outlet store but anyhow, thanks for watching. Um, please like and subscribe if you haven't. And I, I will see you guys all later. Take care. Bye-bye.